Tonight, Christine Beatty, once the most powerful woman in the Kilpatrick administration, is in trouble. Big financial trouble, in fact, owing hundreds of thousands of dollars she cannot pay. 7 Action News investigator Ross Jones joins us now. Ross, it sounds like she's in some deep financial trouble. Sure is, Carolyn. Good evening. As Kwame Kilpatrick's very public fight with the Fed stretches into its third month, Christine Beatty has been waging a much more quiet struggle of her own. Hers is with her finances, and things are looking pretty bleak. As Kwame Kilpatrick faced brutal testimony in his criminal trial today, down in Georgia, things aren't going much better for his old lover and chief of staff. Christine Beatty is crying poor in these court records. In October, she filed Chapter 7 bankruptcy, owing almost $390,000 in liabilities and reporting less than $85,000 in assets. Unlike the former mayor, Beatty's fall from grace has been much less public. She moved down to Atlanta not long after serving jail time for perjury in the text message scandal and found work at an Atlanta law firm as a consultant. Last year, she made more than $100,000, but so far this year, she's made less than a third of that. Nowhere near enough to pay down scores of debts, a $220,000 mortgage for a Detroit home now worth only a fraction, $33,000 in student loans, $42,000 owed on a Ford Explorer, and smaller expenses, too, like a $95 parking ticket in Dallas, where her former lover now lives. As for assets, Beatty doesn't list many, only $2,200 in household goods, $500 in clothing, $250 in jewelry, a far cry for the woman who not long ago was a rising star among Detroit power brokers. Now, she's just broke. A call to Beatty in Atlanta was not returned tonight, but her lawyer told us that bankruptcy was her last choice. We should point out, though, Beatty is up to date with all of her restitution payments to the city of Detroit. You'll remember she agreed to pay $100,000 back in 2008 after the text message scandal. She's paid off about $15,000 so far. Her lawyer said tonight that paying off the rest is her highest priority. Now, Ross, we know she's trying to get her life back together. Any word on whether she's working? or Because it's really difficult to file for bankruptcy today. Uh, she does seem to be working at a law firm. She's a consultant. We're not exactly sure what sort of services she's providing, but her income went down significantly last year, uh, right now, uh, less than she was making last year. Okay. Right. Ross, thank you.